Hey guys, this is Angie and today I will customize this AirPods Pro. This is a step-by-step -step tutorial, so from this video you will learn how to customize different things like AirPods Pro. I hope on your support, I hope you watch this video till the end for me. So let's get started! That's all we need. And the most important thing is the AirPods, of course. Using ordinary acetone, I erase the shiny layer from the AirPods. Be sure to wear gloves if you want to keep your manicure. You can clearly see the difference without the shiny layer. And now we need to draw our sketch. I use just pencil. Also, I draw a border of the drawing, since I will customize only half of the airpods. Stop! At this stage, you also need to protect the important points from the paint using tape, for example. But of course, I forgot to do it. I use Posca acrylic markers. They're perfect for this job and really easy to use. However, it's important to make sure that there is not too much paint, as the paint may crack. But it's really to fix using brush. Some colors, yellow for example, need two coats, but most can be applied in one coat. You also can use a hair dryer to speed up drying. At this stage, everything is pretty easy. Apply the colors one by one. But in small or difficult places for you, you can always help yourself with a brush. In this case, it's better to have brushes of different sizes and shapes. But why do you need to remove the shiny layer from the airports using acetone? Everything is pretty simple. It's necessary so that the paint is well laid and at the same time clears the surface of dirt. If you don't do this, then you simply can't draw anything, the paint will shrink. And I'm lucky because for glasses have a special metallic colors. Just look at how the metallic color is shimmers. And now the most dangerous moment is to outline everything. I use a small diameter marker for this. By the way guys, let me know in comments what to make next time and who to surprise, perhaps my boyfriend? This is what we got and I think it's pretty, pretty cute. What do you think about it? Of course, we need to protect our drawing, so I'm gonna use varnish. Montana colors. Here we can see an example of use. And we are done. So guys, if this video was useful for you, please let me know in comments and I'll try to create more similar content for you. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you so much. Bye bye.